what does Pichu do? Let's have a look at the team. We've got the uh, Porygon Z with the Life Orb here. And the bot Hyper Beam Dog Pulse. Na nasty plot. Okay, nice. And a physical Charizard. Okay. Dreams coming true. Okay. Citrus Berry there. Got Fake Out. Uncle, what speed do you hit little, little old Pichu with your lightning rod? What item have we got? The sash. Okay, that's good. Uh, Spirit Breaks. Okay. Take a Taunt. Crab Hammer. G-Max. Kingler with the Assault Vest. Okay. Now, now this is awesome. And then we got that. Okay. Perfect. What have we got? A Colossal Team. No. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. This is, this is awkward. Um... Well, we do have Pichu and we do have Kingler. Um, hmm. Oh man, we need to lock in super quick. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just locking in because we're like so running out of time. I'm so sorry, dude. Pikachu trainer. We will try and do this with Kingler. At least turn one we can kind of stop the Weavile doing anything. I think Pichu speed ties modest max speed Ludicolo. Yeah, that that's right. Yeah, I think it does with that 123. Yeah. I think a G Max form would take down the Colossal, right? I'm pretty sure it would. Um, but we can fake out the Weavile for sure now. Like they have to protect. I mean the one thing we could do is like double up into the Weavile here. Um You just worry about the colossal maxing and 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 them like are they gonna max i don't know if they will um i feel like they're in a really awkward position like where they need to switch out the weavile and maybe protect the colossal but then if we take down whatever comes in it there's the problem there lies the problem um so they're just gonna get the weavile back onto the field um and be in this same position again we'll go for it though doesn't look like they're switching. They may protect the Colossal here. I don't know. I just don't want to proc the Steam Engine behind a Protect. And I don't think that the uh, G-Max form is going to be enough to uh, to take it down through the Protect. But thankfully, it's a Weavile, not a Sneasel. So we can fake it out. Unless it fakes us out first, obviously. But if it does that, then... It's kind of annoying then, because then we could have just attacked the Colossal. But you, pre you presume in this sort of situation that they're in such a bad spot because if they tried to surf, we fake them out, we get rid of their, their procking, then we're in a decent spot. But we'll see what they do. Okay, Max God, that's perfect. Now if we can get rid of the Weavile here. Okay, it's faking us out, which is fine. Because unless the Weavile's sashed, but then if it is, it's going to be minus two. And Pichu will outspeed at this next turn. So we can just go donk donk. Yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect. Okay. Never thought I'd be playing a, we uh, a Pichu. Um. <laughs> Should we just go for like real, real bants and just encore the Weavile and just take down the Colossal? Let's just, let's just do that. No, it's got a mental herb, right? If it has, we're screwed. We're not screwed. We're, we're going to be fine. This is good. This is good. Okay. Colossal is retreating. Oh my god. They just G-maxed. Max guarded. <laughs> and now they're off. Okay. Well, that's fine. Verizian coming in. That is super fine as well. Because we will encore you, Mr. Weavile. And we'll get a nice G Max form into <clears throat> into Verizian. Put that down to minus two. Wow, that does so much damage. That's nuts damage. It's resisted. Okay. There we go. This is what it's about. This is G Max Kingler. Doing all the good stuff. Um Alright, so I think we'll probably go for a nuzzle into Weavile now, just to do that and I mean, 
Let's just go for another burst, really, because the speed drops are so good. They're so potent. Yeah, whatever comes in on Nuzzle it. I mean, Pichu and King Lao doing such an incredible job. Where is he going to protect? But it's going to be like minus four now. So, I mean, whatever we do this next turn, it's going to be doing so much work. <laughs> Nappy, I have to think of the worst case scenario. It's the best way to look at it. <laughs> Always. Then I'm never disappointed. <laughs> I know what you mean. I know what you mean, dude. Okay. So, minus four, minus two, minus... Well, they're both minus four now with the nuzzle onto the Primarina. This is magic. I love this combination. Pikachu, like, this is just... This is awesomeness. Um, now we can on-call the, uh, the Verizian, but it's probably better to just attack now because um, I think they're going to probably switch Verizian out to bring it back in again. Um, oh, we still got PZ in the back. Let's protect Pichu because I don't think you really go after the Kingler here. Um, mm, maybe Superpower Verizian? <coughs> yeah, let's go for that because I think whatever comes in will take decent damage from it. I know we'll get the defense drops and stuff like that, but oh, they're not switching. Huh. It's interesting. This should take down Verizian. Yep. Okay. I don't think we needed the crit. I'm going to say it now. <laughs> Div Dax, I got. <laughs> I just look up and read the comment. Imagine your opponent's face thinking I'm losing to Pichu. I know, we have to protect Pichu at all costs, okay? So that is the aim of the game. We cannot let Pichu go down. There's no way I'm I'm uh, I'm losing Pichu here. No way. Um, they're going to try and get the steam engine up, you know? They're going to be really cheeky and try and get the steam engine up, I think. Okay. Let's go for the Nuzzle into Weavile, and let's go for a Crab Hammer into Primarina. I just feel like the Colossal's going to come in. Okay, it's not. Okay, that's fine. But they do have Aqua Jet, so we do need to be very careful around the Aqua Jet. Hopefully we don't lose Pichu, because now that would be... Okay, they're going after the Kingler. That's fine. Pichu survives. Kingler goes down, which is sad, but at the same time... Now we're screwed against Colossal. But it is going to be Max Colossal, right? So, um, hmm. We do have Hyper Beam with Thunderbolt. We could Nasty Plot, I guess. We've got no Protect. This is the thing. We need a way to just get rid of... Okay, let's bring in PZ and then let's try and deal with Colossal after that. I think they're going to Aqua Jet. We kind of have to hope that they, um, they're paralyzed. That's what we got to hope for now. They are so disrespecting Pichu. Right, we have to protect. Because then we can maybe, maybe on call the Colossal. Um, I'm going to hyper beam the Prim just to get rid of it. If it's paralyzed this turn, that'd be perfect. This is getting bad now. Okay. No! <laughs> no! Okay, this is not good. This is not good. We need to get rid of the Primarina. Oh no, don't say we're going to go down to this. No, Aqua Jet was good, but... Okay, PZ, you're going to have one more chance. Oh my god, this is like the worst. Um... Can't believe we missed the, the the hyper beam. Oh my god, this is like the worst. Now all we've got is Charizard against Colossal. This is why I don't like PZ. This is why PZ is the worst. <laughs> oh my god, two hyper beam misses in a row. <laughs> Oh. Okay, now we'll now 
Now it's bad. Now we should have we should have encored the the colossal. Um, we need a double. We need literally a double, like both to be paralyzed, both to be paralyzed. We've got to get the double paralysis for this to work. And it's still going to be very iffy. Okay, double paralysis. Come on, I'm visualizing it. I'm visualizing it. Peeps, visualize at home. <laughs> oh. Well, I think we're done. Oh no, they have to charge this turn. Okay, we get the. Okay, this isn't too bad. If they're paralyzed here, then that's not the worst. Uh, we got a rock slide. We got a flinch. Para flinch our way to to victory. We could maybe still do this. Okay. We hit. Okay, we just need one, one, like both of them to be not moved this turn. That's bad. Okay, flinch and flinch. It's come on, come on, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this, we can do this, friends. <laughs> we pull it back. Charizard is gonna do it. Come on, okay. Charizard's like, I'm not letting my little Pichu friend down. We're gonna do this. Come on, come on, Char. Come on. Oh my god. We missed the rock slide. What we missed it onto. The Primarina, we needed to be paralyzed here. Come on. Come on. Paralyzed, 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 par We came close. We did our best. <sighs> we did our best. We did our best. And it wasn't good enough. Harmony, very good game. <laughs> very good game. Unfortunately, we just couldn't do it. Pichu Nelly did it, though. Ah, MF Thang, thank you so much for the follow. Thanks for joining us tonight. I hope you enjoy the stream with us all. Okay. It was so close, guys. It was so close. So close. All right. Well, we're going to give Pichu one more, more run out. Pichu is awesome. And the Kingler did good as well. Okay. Well, Charnelli did it for us. We just needed that one. Well, if we just hit the rock slide. We missed two hyper beams in a rock slide. I swear that that Primarina felt like it had like bright powder attached to it and just nothing hitting it. Okay, we got Sand up next playing Dracozolt, Clefairy, Urshifu, uh, Decidueye, Talonflame, and PZ. So, hmm, what can we do here? I mean, Kingler's not bad. Decidueye makes it a little bit awkward, for sure. Mm. Also, PZ's not bad as well, but I do worry about the Urshifu a little bit. Um... Actually, let's try something. Let's try something. Let's go... Pichu, PZ. I mean, Charizard's pretty decent here, to be honest. Uh, although, Dracozolt causes us all sorts of issues. But, um, okay, let's bring Kingler and let's bring. I'm going to bring Zard again. I mean, Zard was amazing that last game, so for that reason alone, we're going to bring it. We're going to bring it. If we got if we got one of those hyper beams, we would have we would have clinched that match for sure. Because then we could have got Zard in with its with the belly drum, and we still would have probably had PZ at that point. Um, but it happens. It happens sometimes like that. It works out. Sometimes the game says it doesn't want you to win, and then it just yeah it just doesn't work out so well. Um, okay. This is not the greatest lead for us at all. Um, are they going to protect the Clefairy? I think they probably do. Let's go Nuzzle. And I think we've got to max start max striking. 
I don't think we can afford not to, to be honest. I mean, we could fake out the Clefairy, but it's likely the Clefairy knows we've got fake. Do they know we got fake out? We are a Pichu. I don't know how familiar players are with Pichu. We could have probably just went for the fake out. Fake out seems to work a lot of the time when you think it probably wouldn't. Um, <clears throat> but if we can get the, the nozzle into the PZ, it's very helpful. But it may have been better to actually max guard here and then go for the nuzzle into um, into their PZ. In hindsight, that probably would have been a better call, I think. I oh, know, we're just going to see it follow me. Okay. PZ gets benched, yeah. Okay. I don't think we take. Oh, we do take that, okay. Now, do we take down the Clefairy? Because if we can take down this Clefairy, that would be ideal. Because then we get the Nuzzle into the PZ, which will be set us up nicely to be able to uh, to deal with it the following turn. Okay, Clefairy gone. Perfect. We can Nuzzle. And then depending on what comes in next to it... We can maybe nuzzle that as well, max guard, and then go for some big, big attacks. Big, big attacks. Chef J M D, how are you doing? I hope you're well. Thanks for joining us tonight. I hope you enjoy the stream of this. So we're playing rental teams, we're having a lot of fun. So hopefully you do enjoy it. Is this which version for? Is this dark? Uh, no, this is water. I think is it? Let's just check this. Hey, I'm getting better at this. Okay. So, let's go for the nuzzle. Let's go for max guard this turn. And then once they're both paralyzed, we can then go after the PZ the next turn. Like in a perfect world, the P opposing PZ max guards as well, but I don't know if it will. Okay, they're just going surge and strikes, which is fine. So if they're banded, that works out perfectly for us. Um, I'm gonna see. They're going to the Pichu here, max striking. For sure. Okay, I'm putting this down to minus two. Uh, the Urshifu still outspeeds us now, which isn't great. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, the Urshifu still outspeeds us, which is not great. Nappy, 10 gifted subs, dude. Thank you so much, Nappy, mate. That is just too kind, dude. That is far too kind of you. Thank you so much, mate. I really appreciate it. And everyone jumping on the sub train right now, thank you so much, friends. It, uh, all the support means so much. Um, Okay, I think what we'll do is we will um protect Peach. No, we can't protect because there's no point in protecting. Let's go for an encore into Urshifu and let's switch into Kingler. This might not be the best move in the world, uh, just because I think well, you probably go after Pichu if you're Urshifu, and then you go after P PZ. But it's just wasting the move here, so I think we need to preserve PZ um, to come back in and deal with these Pokemon. Surgeon strikes. Zeboa, thank you, and thank you to everyone else. Okay, into Kingler, which isn't the worst. So hopefully they're gone after the Pichu here. Maybe the PZ is fully paralyzed, which would be... Okay, well, we get the Encore, so we're locking it into that. Can't do anything else. This is a good name. Uh, and Nappy is off, is he? Uh, is Nappy leaving? Or is someone leaving? Oh, dude, you did not need to apologize at all, Nappy. But have a great rest of your day, man, whatever you're up to. And uh, as always, it's awesome to have you on the stream thank you so much for the generosity dude um honestly it's incredible um can we okay we're in a good place now where we can actually get rid of the urshifu and the pz in one clean swoop so what we need to do is superpower the pz and go i don't really want a hyper beam i wanted thunderbolt 
they don't yeah thunderbolt should be yeah more than enough what am i talking about and we'll go superpower into the pz and then they got one pokemon left potentially if we don't see switches here which they which we might do okay no switches which is great so yeah enough perfect and then superpower come on kingler be enough to get this pz please be enough i mean if it doesn't it's still not the worst it is enough okay there we go there we go. <sighs> That's good. Nappy, you are the god of all gods. I'm doing a whole thing, shiny event, then spooky October. Uh, would you join me, dude? I would love to. I'd love to. The spooky dens are are, are great this month. I think they'll be a very fun um, special event this month for. Halloween, I would imagine. We'll knock off. We'll try and get this. I don't know if we'll... Yeah, we get the dog pulse. I don't know if this would be enough. It'll do a good chunk, though. And then sets up Charizard to come in. Ooh, okay. Weakness policy. Why are they gone, though? Are they... Yeah, they... Well, yeah, we kind of take away their options there. So it depends. Yeah, energy ball. Okay. But we got Zard in the back to come in and clean up first and hopefully Zard like last game can come in and do some stuff and we can pick up a win with this team which is good star shiny event uh nice that sounds awesome dude um more fire punch and that should be enough hopefully without the belly drum boost we don't need it fire punch should be enough from Zard Zard's got decent base attack as well so I'm presuming yeah okay Whew. good game to my opponent we finally pick up a little a little victory with that one so uh pikachu trainer thank you so much for the team and thank you for the pichu very very fun to play very fun to play